And then Andy, go, uh, go get me some of these screws like this, because we got to screw these in, too. Why don't you grab the whole bag? I'm thinking I should maybe make a shim to put behind this top one. Mm -hmm. This one has a shim underneath it already, but I think I, I got to widen. I think I got to widen that shim out too. Uh, and then because now it uh, I don't know if it's still too tight so or not. I wonder if the other brackets. For the other rail, have a little bit more play in it. But that seems like a pain. Yeah, that that play. Play. Right, I need to get it on here, Andy. So the question is then, how tight did you make it down at the bottom? I pulled it all the way out. All the way, okay. And a little bit of gap between there, but I suppose that's okay. What gap between the just jam? the jam, yeah. Well, you could push it in just a little bit if you want to then. I don't want to make it too tight though is the problem. I don't think there's much of one. Leave it at that. That's a little bit louder. I got the hard side. Actually, I need a screwdriver. Phillips. Up one. Uh, here we go. Yeah, right here. Let's go with that one. Let's do this the easier way. No, that won't be the easier way.
Is that working? Okay, one more. Taking out the entire tracker. Mm -mm. Putting a bigger, putting a thicker shim in there. Now we can use both wraps. When he's done, we'll put this. We have to do the same thing with this done. side, though. Eventually, we'll get it figured out. I know. Still recording? Huh? Still recording? about right. I pulled it off pretty good now. So. Yeah. You didn't have any problems in the back there. Huh? It's all bent up now.